Superman at I'm going to do a little shout out for my homie 45 pure 2770 and T Mills 97 wanted to shout out too. We're going to be doing um Falador Teletab running. You're also going to need 47 construction and uh 40 magic. A dust staff and a mist battle staff. The uh mist battle staff runs for about 200k and the dust one runs for about 90k. In the GE, it's going to say that the mist one is really expensive, like 420k, but really you can buy it for like 200k. So I'm going to teach you guys how to make the stuff you need inside of your house. The rooms you're going to need in your house are a quest hall for a mounted glory and a study for an eagle lectern. To make a study, you need 50k. Um, you're also going to need 25k. And the items you'll need are two oak planks and three teak planks, a regular glory without any charges on it, and make sure you have a saw and a hammer. Alright, so start off by uh, teleporting to your house with the materials to make the mount of glory and uh, the eagle lectern. Click on your settings tab. Click on your house options and then go into building mode. Once you're in building mode everything will turn white that you can build on and you're basically just gonna go to a door one of these doors um, try to find an empty one like over here uh, make sure you build this quest hall close to your main portal and once you see the empty one click uh, right click build build yourself the hall quest trophies it costs 25k to do it we're gonna go ahead and build it you're gonna right click the guild trophy space click build and then once you do that you'll be able to see amulet of glory and since you have three take planks and an amulet of glory uncharged you can just click it and it'll make one for you. Boom. Then you can right click it to teleport to Edgeville. The next room you're going to need is a study. To make a study you need 50k. And also level 40 construction. Go ahead and build your study. And then you'll see a uh, lectern space. Once you see the lectern space, right click on it, click build lectern space. And you'll have uh, three options for the oak planks. Uh, oak lectern, eagle lectern, and demon lectern. Go ahead and build the eagle lectern. Once you have that built, you'll be able to make tabs. You should have these lit up. Um, to make the Falador tabs, you're going to need air runes, um, water runes, and law runes. Um, but if you have the mist staff, like I do, you're just going to need a law rune for each uh, clay. We're going to just go ahead and go back to uh, Edgeville real quick. So click Edgeville teleport on your mounted glory. Once you're here, I like to keep my um, screen south instead of north. Go ahead and click on the bank. Deposit all your stuff. Pull out your dust battle stuff, your mist battle stuff. Next. For every tab you make, it'll cost one law rune. And you will also need one law rune to teleport to your house. So let's go ahead and get our law runes out. I want to make 100 tabs. So if you plan on making 100 tabs, bring 4 extra law runes. So I'm going to pull out 104 law runes. Next, you're going to pull out your soft clay. 
So once your inventory looks like this, and you have your dust battle staff equipped, go ahead and go to your spells tab and teleport to your house. And go over to your Eagle Lectern. To make all of them, you're going to need your Mist Battle Staff equipped. And click Make All Falador Teleport. So, yeah, your dude's going to do this little emote for a good while. But once you've completed converting them, go ahead and uh, click the Edgeville Teleport on your Mounted Glory. Alright, so we've got 25 tabs. Edgeville Teleport. Switch back to your Dust Staff. Go to the bank. And withdraw 25 soft clay. Boom. There's three spaces taken up. Uh, I usually don't bank my tabs after I make them. I just leave them in my inventory. Uh, I'll leave one tab for my law runes and one tab for my extra staff. And we're going to go back to the house. Go ahead and throw your miss battle staff back on. And you don't have to do make X. I just have a habit of it because so many skills require you to do make X. But you can just go ahead and do make all. All right. Um, usually in my house, my glory is like right here, and my um, study is right there. Um, I'll go ahead and calculate about how much you make per hour. Uh, the soft clays run at about 150 each. The law rune runs at about 200 each. So basically, soft clay is 150 each. A law rune is 197 each. So it costs about 350 to make a Falador tab. A Falador tab runs in the GE for about 575. 227 profit per times 1200 is about 270k profit an hour. And um, I'll do the experience rates for you guys as well. If you can make 1200 an hour times 50 experience each, you make about 60k experience an hour doing this for magic. So you're making 60k experience an hour in magic, and you're also making almost 300k an hour in profit. So it's a great way to train up your magic to, I did it from one, or from, uh, what is it, 40 to uh, 65, so I could do Lunars. Um, I think that's about it. I'll go ahead and show you guys uh, one more time the perfect method I use. So um, first things first, click on the bank. Make sure you have your dust staff equipped. Try to keep your soft clays and a tab where you can remember it. After you click on the bank, go ahead and withdraw your 25. Teleport to your house with your dust staff on so you save the earth and the air room that it costs. Run on over. While you're running over, equip your steam staff. Click on the lection. Click make all. Once you finish your tabs, go ahead and um, click on the Edgeville Teleport, switch back to your desk staff, click on the bank, pull out your 25 soft clay, go to your house, switch back on your mist staff, go to your lectern, Make all. All right, there we go. Hundred tabs. Um, go ahead.
go ahead and click on your Edgeville Glory. And that's it. You've made your times and you've made your profit. <laughs>